everyone, it's Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to add music to your live stream using OBS. And this is relatively easy. So select your correct scene over here on the left, and then go to Sources and go to the plus icon. And then go on over to VLC Source, right here, VLC Video Source. Select this, and I just name it whatever you want. Music would probably be good. Then go to OK. Then at the top, we have Loop Playlist, Shuffle Playlist. Check mark what you want, then visibility behavior. The default is stop when not visible and restart when visible. So most of the time I just like going to pause when not visible and on pause when visible. And then the last option is always play even when not visible. So choose wherever you want and then go to the plus icon right here. You can go to add files from your computer, add directory or add pathway or URL right here. So maybe you have an online playlist you want to go and just copy over. Well, you can try copying it into here. But I'm going to go to Add Files and locate some music on your computer, wherever you have it. So here's a music folder. I got nothing in there. But I'm just going to add a video to it. All right, and then we can scroll on down. We do have Properties right here if we want to go to it. It doesn't open up anything. Properties. There we go. It's the, uh, the pathway for it. Now, we have Network Caching, Audio Track, Subdale Track. I usually don't do anything with those. Let's just go to OK. Now the video is going to be playing on here uh, since I don't have music. But if you go to your desktop audio, scroll on down under audio mixer, you can see music's playing in here. Just make sure this is the appropriate level. And then if it's not loud enough, we can go to the uh, little three little dots right here and go to filters. And then go to the plus and then we can go to um, just a gain. So we want to go up to audio video filters right here and then add gain. And this will allow us to make it louder. So we can increase the decibels right here. So I don't know what would be a good mount, but you can see the music is definitely louder under the mixer. So we have that. Now, another thing that we could do is go to uh, the properties for this. This brings us back to here if we want to add more tracks in the future or anything like that. So just monitor the music under the audio mixer just to make sure it's good. And hopefully this quick little video did indeed help you guys out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more tech help videos coming up next on Your 6 Studios.